Let's settle a few things. Yeah. People have always said a dog's mouth is cleaner than a human's mouth. Yes, so I've it's always okay heard that. if they lick you and wash you with right. your own mouth. Right. Right. True. Uh, no. I oh. Mean, so okay. Good to know. If you culture a dog's mouth, I mean, you're going to find just as many or more bacteria than you're going to find in a person's mouth. Really? Okay. So yeah, it's not that it's cleaner. I mean, they do have some anti antibacterial properties to their saliva, but okay. really, that's not. You know, I, I, I don't get wounds and, and go straight to having dogs licking them. Would that, that wouldn't be the case because then, because um, we have a couple of people here that on do set that, that quite a bit, love this. Honest. Like, <laughs> Larissa just is getting the whole yeah, facial done there with, with the her. licking, right. the, everything from the yeah. lower jawline. And then, um, oh, is that you, is, Jade? Yeah, that's you, mine, Jade. Oh, well, you're kissing so. your dog, so that's I know. in reverse. Yeah, you're it's a reverse. So we probably should check. I mean, swab your mouth to see if you got germs. Would you get sick if you? Let the dog kiss you like that? No, I mean, unless, okay. unless you're immunocompromised, no. And, and, okay. Yeah, not, not at all. It wouldn't work. They're not giving you the flu or anything? No, no. Okay. I mean, some, some, yeah, in general, no. no but that's an actually a good question. <laughs> can, can dogs catch colds from you and vice versa? Not really. Okay, good okay. to know. Good. All right, so my dog did not give me my cold. I'm kidding. Yeah. Shane, I know you have a question. Other pets can, though. Really? Yeah, like no. birds, for instance. Can give you a cold? Get, yeah, like a birds can get something called chlamydophila, and it's not like the... <laughs> not like what we think of with that, but yeah, yeah that yeah. can cause like an upper respiratory infection in people as it does in birds. Oh my wow. So it depends on the animal. Yeah. All right. Oh, interesting, Jay. Now I have a question. Yeah. Um, so dogs wag their tail and people just automatically assume that they're happy. That's true, right? Or is there... There are, that, that can be true. Mm -hmm. There's many reasons dogs wag their tail. Right. And so it could be from being nervous or anxious mm. um, or upset. You know, it, it really depends. And so it, it comes down to actually the the angle of how they're wagging it and how fast they're wagging their tail that you can kind of gain some perspective on that. So it's, it's tough as a pet owner to really know. I, I'm familiar with my little dog Henry's tail wagging, so if it's a tight little tail wag, I can tell he's actually probably nervous. If it's a big, broad, happy tail wag, then it's like, okay, he's happy. You know? yeah. but, but will an angry dog wag a tail? Like, I've always thought Sometimes. if I saw a dog who was angry, their tail's no. not wagging, I'm like, oh, this one, the dog's True. really like... Probably not. Okay. It's probably tucked. Um, but but it's possible, and so okay. you have to kind of read other cues, like if they're growling or snarling, yeah. or kind of backing away. Right. Like, you know, there, there's a lot of things. But if they're, you know, front of their bodies down, their butts up, wagging yeah, their tail, and they're, they're happy, like, <laughs> they're good. You know, they're doing um, downward dog. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Fish don't have. Well, they do have tails, I guess. Um, yes. yes. Uh, question for you: Is it true that fish will only grow to the size of the environment they're in, like a fish bowl, like a goldfish? That's yeah. Will only grow to the it size. It can of the stunt bowl. their growth. And so being in a small space like that. Uh -huh. And so if, if you were to take that fish out and get them in a bigger space, they might go on and continue growing. So it can slow down and stunt their growth. And they, so is they that will. like cruelty to fish if you keep it in the It small? is, yeah. It it's is? not like, okay, it's not like, oh, we're just, you know, he's just, we're going to keep him this size. Yeah. That's okay. It's, it's, this it's is our fish in the grub. Right. This, is, um, <laughs> this is glub. 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 Glub, 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 glub was very um, glub was very small early on, and then we got yes. a bigger tank for him. He's and a total he finally glub. grew, grew a Glub bit. is the first yeah. cast member on the show. He was <laughs> here before anybody else was. I'm not kidding. He and Dave were building the joint. 